It is another beautiful day in Ohio, and it's Ride Up Buddy Bike Day. This is my buddy James, 2024 CRF450. It's brand new. He's only got a couple hours on it now. And um, James was a suspension tech in a former life. He runs a business now, but he uh, he just set it up, and he's pretty happy with it. He's working. This is uh, He got some Lanier stuff, L-A-N-I-R, out of uh, Podium MX in California. This stuff's from Italy, so he changed the high-speed compression. He's running a Pro Circuit linkage in the back, and... And he revalved his forks. I think he put a check valve in to isolate the rebound. And I think he has a trampoline mid, mid speed now um, instead of float. But he's real happy with it. I'm excited to ride it. Last week I rode a CRF 450 Works Edition with just triple clamps on it. I'm curious to see how this thing feels. Um, I've, you know, I've had the, the Hondas before, and there's always a general kind of global firmness to the bike. But I've. I know riding the RXs, the suspension setting feels better, but James is a fast rider, so we'll see if his setting works for me. Slow vet guy. Well, right away, I know this grass looks nice and smooth, but there's some little chop in it. I can feel how smooth, kind of how smooth it is. Almost feels kind of like the works edition which has those coatings so just a little tiny chop it's kind of disappearing definitely has a little more comfort and I know he could he's dialed this for a fast motor guy but it still has a good progressiveness to it from what he said and he rides fast so that he can still hit the stuff and it has better hold up. He felt the stock forks were just kind of diving a little bit more than he wanted. Yeah, that, even just a simple slap down like that, it feels way better. Because usually on a CRF you have that kind of kind of harsh feel to it. I'm gonna get a little clear track here. Yeah, the way the back kind of the back floats over some of those bumps. map one stock yeah that thing that front end just just floats into the yeah I wanted to even coming up short on that man it's got good bobbing resistance these Hondas they just they feel so good in the corners just the way they lay down the front has such good traction man that rear just floats over that I like that and I think with the front listen he's got the fork slid all the way down but even on the faster stuff, it does not feel unstable. Man, I wish you could jump this thing. It's just the side wind is psyching me out. Oh, it's just so playful. Okay. Wow, James did a great job with this. I have always liked the way CRFs, just the ergos, the way they go into the corners, that corner initiation. They're playful, but boy, I know it looks stock, but it sure doesn't feel stock. Kind of makes me wonder, works edition, put the linkage on it, but 
What a good setup. I'll have to get some info from James. I'll put it in the description, some of what he's working on. But boy, two huge thumbs up. This might be the best suspended 450 Honda I've ridden to date.